This is the Hi. third episode in the TED series, yeah, it is. Super Face 3. Yeah, it is. This game started being made in 2000 yeah. and was finished in 2000 and never. Yeah, it wasn't. But now it is finished in this 2013 remastered edition. Yeah, it is. This is also the final episode in the series. I know. Now play Super Face 3. Yeah, I will. Thanks. Ah. Super Phase 3, the worst one, I think. Although, um, people have said it's good, so whatever. See you in the game! Yeah, you will! You're late again, Ted! Oh, an intro! Sorry! That's okay, thanks! Ha ha ha! Curse you all! Yeah. I need to get our bodies back! Good luck, Ted! Yeah, that was a prequel! And now we are in current day! Oh, it's this again. You see, you can tell it's crap already. Reusing old ideas. That's basically what this game is. No, it isn't. But it does have the whole inside the dinosaur bit again. But other than that, I guess this game's alright. Lava caves. It's not a very secret entrance if it's on, like, oh, you'll see. It's not very secret at all. Ah, a big face. Use it as an elevator. Oi! Fine, I'm just climbing over this instead. Never mind. It's very dodgy, and Ted blinks in this one. In fact, everything does. Yeah, blink. Um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, it, you probably watched the other two episodes already, but if you haven't, I'll say it again. Look in the video description if you want a link to the advertisement video, which will contain links to the free downloads of this trilogy if you want to play them for yourself. But if not, just keep watching! God! Yep, there's the echoey death again. There needs to be one in every game. Oh no! It's a bonus It is. Don't fall in. Ah! Very dodgy platforming. This game's kind of more of a game than just a random mishmash of randomness. Oh look. We've got a boss already. Oof. Pardon me, do you want to know the best way to beat it? Yeah, so you don't have to keep doing this. That just takes forever. Hello, uh, Ted. Oh, hi. My name is Floating Perry. Oh. I will give you a new power. Oh. Useless. You can now cast Q's by pressing C. I'm fine. We can't use it for very long. Oh yeah. Try it in this training level. Oh, I will. Hello, I'm evil. Kill me. I can tell you're evil. Yeah. Not like that stupid. Jeez me. Do you have a good microphone? No. Jeez. Yay. I'm dead now. Turn up. Oh, okay. That was fun. Oh, so you have passed training. I do say, well done. Thanks, mate. Yep, that was Floating Perry. Right, let's cheese everything. Cheese. That doesn't work. What's the point of giving me a power if it doesn't work? God. Oh my god. Oh. I just did that to show it. Not because I forgot. And you thought the boss was a big Venus flytrap, Ted Trap, I mean. Yeah, you have to cheese these. It's very dodgy. Oh. Ah. Alright, run. Dodgy. I think I already said dodgy. 
See, this game is just kind of repetitive. Or is it? No, it's not yet. It's alright for now, maybe, hopefully. Boss time! This bloody game and its bosses. I don't know why it throws parts, but I guess you can just stand here. I didn't know that. Yeah, this is the secret entrance, apparently. It's very not obvious. Who would ever find it? Hello? Your mission is to find and defeat the evil lava creature who is helping the plan to blow up the world! Oh my god! See, it's still the same story. We're going and killing all the ice creatures' mates. Ah! Oh. Yeah, in the first game you were saving his wife, Mrs. Face. In the second game, we were saving the world from the evil ice creatures and in this game we're also saving the world and we're also trying to get everyone's bodies back we can't use cheese anymore by the way you can use it in like three screens up. Oh. after you get it you can use it in like a total of three screens kill the evil demonic waffles by the way sorry I forgot to point out that they are waffles kill them Kill these ones quickly. Wow. Because it gets very dodgy if they're in the way while you're ride <coughs> while you're riding this. Sorry, voice naff up. Basically you have to ride this until you get to the other side. And then jump off! Oh, oh bloody hell. If you ride it the whole way it's easier. Kind of. Well, not completely, because sometimes you hit your head on the sky. Or I guess it's the roof of the cave. But you know, sometimes you just don't want to ride it that long. So you just want to jump off earlier. See, it's dodgy! But I guess I'll ride it all the way. Because I don't know when it's safe to jump off. Originally, it didn't actually drag you along with it. There, let's just go. You had to move with it. So it was very awkward. I don't know how anyone ever did it. That's the point, they didn't. Because no one played it other than me. Another boss, by the way. Just didn't find it to be worth mentioning. It has lots of health, but yeah, shoot, shooting those lava balls are what do lots of damage. Well, that's probably one of the harder Hello, bosses. Uh, oh! I my I know. Nothing to give you this time! Yeah, that was one of the harder bosses, I think, because you have to keep jumping over the rocks. Bye! Taffy! I don't know why there is ta I don't know why there is Taffy. But there is. It's taffy and we're killing it. Oh! Taffy. What the hell, man? What you got against taffy? I don't even know what taffy is. I guess it's like chewy stuff in Sweden. Swedish taffy. I don't bloody. And the best part is they fart when they die. I don't know why I did that. That was obviously not not a good time. Oh, I was looking at the microphone because I thought they all died. <laughs> don't try and drop down there, by the way, to cut out some of the level. Oh, why did I do that? Because it drops you into the lava. Oh! Right, concentrate, please. Let's play this properly. Because this game needs a lot of concentration. You can use the old wolf trick. It's not quite as useful here, though. There we go. 
be careful of this one, don't die. Good. That would have been a bad time to die. Bloody hell. Oh, I got stuck. I was trying to see if I could drop down there. But no, you can't. Oh, stop rushing. Sorry. Some walkthrough. Oh, God, I'm rushing again. By the way, you see that glowing orb down there? Try and ignore its existence. You don't want to go for it. But now then, while you're here, try and snipe these. Gosh, stop dodging it. Thank you. Yeah, don't go down for it because you can't get back up and it doesn't do anything. Picking it up just goes, hello. And then you're stuck down there and you have to die. Oh, God. Now, apparently this is brown. It was supposed to be red. But yeah, I find the best way to av avoid everything it does is be on the ladder. And just move up and down. Oop. Don't move up and down if it's going to move you into some lava. If it even is lava, because it's apparently brown. Stupid colour blind. Wait, did I already... I know I already said it's brown, but... I don't know if I already said stupid colour blind. Oh! Okay, that's that. That boss was ridiculous originally. Yeah, just tuck that on the end there. Two of three islands. You can't get off an island. It doesn't have anything with which to get off. Oh, you mean like get off it as in leave it? Oh, hi. I can see that. Cool. You can now cast apple by pressing A. What? Oh god! Why is it always cheese and apple? Um, uh, I don't know. Try it in this training level. I don't know why it's always cheese and apple. Hello, I'm evil. Kill me. Not like that stupid apple No. Apple, yay. It's just the same as cheese. Pardon me. Okay, so in the next level. Here we are in the next level. Cheese. No, no, here you can use cheese. cheese, cheese. cheese. It's just this again. Cheese. But with a few taffies thrown in. Yeah, you can't yeah. use apple. Can't use apple here. It doesn't tell you you can use cheese again. This is such a bad game. For some reason I started putting these powers in and I don't know why. Oh look, boss time. No, not yet. Don't try and use cheese on those, it doesn't work. What's the point? What is the point of having these powers? The only bloody thing it works on is the metal blocks. Giant taffy. It has a predictable pattern. But it'll, di it'll die before it matters, apparently. Yep, that was the island revisited. By the way, this is the level after this level. This is the level after this level that Perry was talking about. Perry the platypus. No. Okay. We can use Apple now. No, we can't. We can only use it in one screen. And it's not even required to be used. Oh. Disintegra disintegration lasers. Be very careful. Oof. Okay. Oh, God. Got stuck on a step. This game's long. It Come on! Right, thanks. This game's too long. Ah, I don't know. I don't know why is there. I don't know why there is a man with a teacup for a head. 
kicking everything. I don't know why you explode, but yeah, this is the only screen you can use Apple. And there's not even any point. Just shoot him. Bloody hell! And if you kill him, he goes... No! Oh! That's where the no! came from. That you some that you sometimes hear in my videos. Random gun. You can't use Apple anymore. Oh! No, you can't even shoot. I thought you could on this screen. Oh bloody hell! Why am I so not good at this today? Oh god! Come on! Right, there we go. Jumping on the gun goes splat. Gibbs's mouse trap. Suddenly you can jump higher. Don't ask me. Because I don't know. You see, the story with the Gibbs's mouse trap is there was a teacher in school, and his name was Mr. Gibbs. And he used to come up with silly inventions and stuff, and one of them was a mouse trap that shot fire. Yeah. Oh no, it's another kicking man. You can't shoot or anything. This one disintegrates you. Oh. Ow! Ow! This room's ridiculous because you have to get lucky with where these things fall. So good luck doing it. <laughs> I don't know what he says. Oh! What a complete copy! Good luck. Good luck figuring out what he's saying. Oh! This game's too loud. Oh! Oh. Mm. Run! Oh, another boss. He's the guardian of the mustache. Oh, bloody hell. Yeah, there are. Yep. Now, if you want to know what that bloke was saying, he was saying, oh, I'm a very big bloke with a big head. And the second time was, that blimmin' hurt. Yeah. This game's too freaking loud. Oh, okay. Oh, all right. Press escape to skip it. There are very dangerous fish and stuff down there. This is a boat, by the way. I don't know why it's purple or pink or whatever when it was silver when we first went into it. Whatever. Oh my god, it's like Red Faction. Look at that Geo Mod technology. Yeah, man. And it's... Oh. Nothing. Don't worry. Run! And it's another... Boss. Oh. It's the underwater version of Rejax and he's dead. Sorry, I was using my rapid fire finger. You can shoot as fast as you can press control. Oh, hi. That's all right, mate. Such voice acting. The other island. Oh, islands. Too many. Too many islands. I will. I'll do that. We are suddenly bombarded with coughs. 
I don't know why they would go into the sky, but whatever. Oh yeah, don't shoot them. They are Mr. Polo Holes. And they move with you. And jumping makes them fly away, apparently. It's annoying, because you move slower, because they're touching the side of the screen. Mr. Polo dead. Yeah. Mr. Polo Holes dead. And these ones control like cars. So left and right steers them, and forward makes them accelerate. Don't kill them either, though. Okay, we can go now. And now, what have we got? Another boss, of course! Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Now be careful when it leaves the side of the screen. Summons some Mr. Polo holes. So you have to make them run into you. The end. Oh! Oh, what a complete copy! Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh, you will not beat me this time. I will live victorious of smashing all existing bottles oh. in this realm. Oh. Catch me if you can! I've got a new improved bottle machine! <laughs> Voice acting of when I was like, I don't know how old. Teeth! Um. Ah, uh, oh, it's okay. Yeah. But do you want to witness the best death in the world? Oi! Well, not, not necessarily the best death, but the best death sound effect. Here we go! What? That's quieter than I thought. Bloody hell, it's supposed to be loud. Oh well. It's fine. You didn't hear it. Moment ruined. Yeah. Now these ones actually do raise. Oh! When you land on the small platforms, it makes them speed up. When you land on the long platforms, it slows them back down. It's very dodgy. It's an alley. Ubada! More teeth. Sorry, I'm just whizzing through this without even... Why is there a pterodactyl pooping? How dodgy. This, this game is just... This game is just ridiculous. Oh, you know what they say, games get worse. Oh, so you killed my pet, have you? Oi! Well, that was very nice of you, wasn't it? I think you even more now. Can't get me if you dare. What? What the fuck is he on about? Bet you can't catch me. Can't? Why are you suddenly American? Bet you can't catch me. You have to just jump over five bottles. That's it. That's it, we're done. Boss time. God! Bosses! You have to shoot the red bottles, I think. I think it's the red ones. Or something. Let's find out. Yeah. But do you want to know the best way to beat this boss? Dodge the green one. Yeah. Dodge the green one. I don't know why walking into it makes it far. Dodge the green one. Yeah. His eyes are closed. Whoa. What's that? What does it look like? A rocket. Space. No, not the final frontier. The final front nose. Yes. Yes, 
definition is defined the cloaked space space in space. This game just goes on too long, doesn't it? And we're only like, I don't know, 70% done maybe? I don't know. Well, at least these levels are kind of unique. They have a theme. They're a bit not more interesting. I don't know what they are. They're just levels. Yeah, the second one will always be my favourite in the series. I also cut a few bosses from this remastered edition. So since since the downloads include the old original versions, you could see how bad it used to be compared to how bad it still is. Hold right on this screen. Yeah. And jump onto this. Oi! What was that? There's an elevator. And here we are, at the flashing purple thing. Unless it's blue, you have to run across them when they're going down. Yeah, that was space. I must have been eating the microphone when I was recording all this. Oh. That was easy. That was easy too. Bye! <laughs> The best part about this game is some of the deaths. They don't make sense. What does this one do? Oh, actually, I think it's just the same death. Never mind, it's chasing me. Ah, we have a mini game instead of a boss. Yeah. Click on the buttons to move your ship. And that is the shoot button, and you have to shoot the enemy ship. No, come over here. Do you know? Right. But do you want to know the best way to win that? Just fly into the enemy. You both explode, but you still win. Oh no! Mouth. Oh hi. Oh, here we go. We're almost done, kind of. Ugh. This game. The final boss is good, at least, I reckon. Oh, hi. Hi, Giant Ted. To get into the dinosaur cave, you need to sort out my food. Yeah, you have to click on all his get food. I will. The music. Get my apples. It's the best music. Hurry up. Get my lettuces. It's not lettuces, it's lettuce. There's even some cabbage there. Get my cheeses. Can't have apples without cheese. There we go. Oh, thanks, mate. Yeah. Thank you much. You're welcome. Mmm! Mm. If you don't do it quick enough, you have to start it over. What, the whole game? Right, we're going inside the dinosaur. Oh, apparently we're not. Shoot this one. Yeah. Don't walk under the dinosaur butts. I'm not even going to show you what happens. It's just not called for. God, sorry. Oh, fine. Oh, God. Disgusting. Climb over the dinosaurs. I don't know why they've got holes all over them. It's just weird. As in, a lot of parts of them are transparent and you can see the background. Hello. What is with all the dinosaurs? What a copy! Unarrested. 
that method is to somehow get out of the dinosaur. Such an original. Just hurry through the rest Splash. of the Oh yeah, getting hit by the saliva kills Splash. you in this one. Splash. Let's just hurry. Splash. Get out of this game. Oh no! Oh. Splash. Look! Splash. Splash. It's so boring, I didn't even Splash. bother... Splash. Splash. I didn't even bother Splash. changing Splash. the levels. They're still square. Splash. Because it's just Splash. unnecessary. Splash. 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 This one has square insides. We'll just leave it at that. So I just can't be asked. I was just like, why did I do this? Such lazy. I'm not even gonna bother changing it. Now we have to fight the heart. It's not even interesting. Oh bloody hell. How annoying. I've never died to that boss. Maybe I have, I don't know. Why does it have arms and legs? I don't know. God. We're leaving the heart now. We're in the kidneys again. Where apparently there is saliva dripping. I don't know how. Let's leave the kidneys and go into the stomach again. <sighs> Except in this one, you can press all the letters on your keyboard. P. Jam. Jam. If you've watched my original Silent Hill playthrough, that's where the jam originated. Jam. Yeah, because I couldn't think of any foods that start with those. Oh. And it opens up the exit because the dinosaur is full now, so you can leave. Right, let's go. Right, if you can't go now, yeah, I get so good, and I'll give you a new power. Yay! Now I can fly. You can now fly for a limited time only. I know. I'm fine. I just told them that. Oh yeah. <sighs> Try it in this training level. No, you don't get a training level. There's no point being able to fly. There's just no point. It doesn't help. It's not necessary. I don't know why. Originally, you had to fight the acid dude again as well. And it had pretty much the same pattern as the heart boss. So that's why I removed it. Because it was just boring. This is all boring, really. Okay, we're done. Let's get out of here. I don't know why the intestines are green this time. I see light. Yeah, you do. This is... And now, this time we come out and... Disgusting. Ah. That was unnecessary as well. Right, we're in a forest. We just killed a fly. Let's go. Oh god, run. She gets angry. That's death. That's death. You have to kill them. Whoa. No, originally you had to kill all of them to be able to progress, but now you just have to get past them. Oh god. This is the area that got the most cut out from. There used to be a screen where there were Pepsi cans bouncing around. Yeah, beehives, very clever. There also used to be a boss, which was one of those heads, and it was big and it shot electricity from its eye and mouth. Oh! Hoovers! I don't know why there are hoovers in the forest. Yep, we killed hoovers, now we've got a boss. Gibbs's ulti pen. Shoot the ink before it hits the floor. Yep, that was that boss, let's continue. Oi, say it properly! The tower! 
that was by Ewan, that voice there. From Bart. A cow will, God. Last level. World. What? Bang! Die. Angry face. Die, devil rider. It rides devils. No, it is a devil and it's riding. I would ride a devil. What? Yep. It's nothing compared to the Tower of the Giza or whatever. No. Oh! As in, it's nothing compared to Giza Tower. This bloody game is nothing compared to the Giza Adventure. We're almost done here, don't worry. This is the last level before the final boss. The final boss resides at the top of a tower. How typical. Right, and this was the last level I actually made before I cancelled making this game. But I brought it back to be remastered and I added the final boss and the intro and the ending. And I got out, got rid of a lot of stuff too. Oh no! It's finally the end of Ted's long journey. It is. And now it's time to face off. Get it? Face off. Against the evil sorcerer. You better be ready because the fate of everyone's body is at stake this time. Yeah. Okay. I am ready, don't worry. Here we go. Final boss. <laughs> How easy. Just follow him. Now return everyone to normal. Fine. Thanks. Nice one, Ted. Thanks. Now get to work. Oh. Yep. That was Super Phase 3. You could tell the final boss and the intro and outro were made. Uh, the intro and the ending were made now, can't you? Probably, yeah. And not only because the the voice quality is better, and I'm not eating the microphone while doing it. Anyway, yeah, that was the Super Face trilogy. I hope you enjoyed them at least some amount. Again, if you want to play them for yourself, find the link to the advertisement video in the description below. And that advertisement video will contain the download links. It's a free trilogy and it also includes the original three games with slight modifications to make them at least playable, beatable and stuff if you want to see what they used to be like. And um, it also includes written guides. Yeah I spent a lot of time on this but now I'm off to work on another better game. Oh, okay bye, thanks for watching.